Today we have another bias guide for doll collectors and gift givers are like featuring brand new American Girl Truly, Truly Me Pets. Pets. Here's all of the new AG pets that we have purchased. The only one we didn't get yet was the little Chihuahua, which is very interesting. That Chihuahua was back ordered and not sure when we're gonna get um, that little guy, but we shall see. <laughs> <laughs> and we also bought the puppies, which are adorable. First up, we're gonna talk about the Daffodil Doodle. She's really cute. I haven't named any of these dogs yet because I have that's, that's a lot of names, so I'll have to come up with them. Or you could help me out in the comments, let me know. So first up, each pet has a little description, which is adorable. The Daffodil Doodle will brighten your day like a ray of sunshine when someone needs help. She's the first to lend a paw. Make her day special with a fun trip to the dog park. Cute. Plus, there's a little group photo of all the pets that are available right now. And this box can be turned into a little dog house, which I think is super cute if you don't, you know, have a lot of pet items or if you just want a little pet house. That's an easy thing to do. It's already ready to go. Here's a dog with the tissue paper. Tissue paper was plain. It didn't have AG on it, which was interesting. Such a shock for us doll collectors. We're like, what? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Here is Miss Daffodil out of the box. She looks adorable. She has like this curly fur. And of course, a magnetic toy. If you aren't familiar with these dogs, they all come with a magnetic toy. This one's a dark purple with a little heart and a paw on it. It's like a little bone. That's really cute. And the dog is a very beautiful golden brown, and the dog is very soft, but also a different texture. Not plushy, but like the fur feels kind of curled or like like short, but it's still a soft dog. It's very hard to explain because in person it just feels totally different. The dog can sit down, move their little limbs. Their limbs are posable. Their head is movable. Oh, and by the way, just in case you didn't know, the dog retails for $30. Not a bad price for a little movable pet. I remember back in the day, you know, the dogs were just like a block sitting there. <laughs> Which is cute, but like it was just, you know, you, you, could all, you couldn't do much. I think it's cool that you can move their head back and forth. And she has little brown eyes and a little black nose and a little embroidered mouth, which you can barely see because of all the fur. But I think she's really adorable. And I'm glad that they're kind of experimenting with more dog breeds and more cat breeds and I think that's cool because different people have different animals and they might want to get a mini like pet for their pet for right. them <laughs> for their nanny me <laughs> which is so adorable next up is the Shipu sweetie she retails for $30 you can also take her box and make it into a doghouse as well Shipu sweetie is a true diva pup she loves strutting through the neighborhood to show off her elegant style Keep her pampered with weekly visits to the doggy day spa. And she comes with her purse accessory, which is just adorable. They had a light pink one. I like how they changed the color to dark pink. So just in case you got the light pink, now you can have two. This That's is cool. really cute. She comes, her little face is plush. And then you can see um, a close-up of the purse there. It has a bow and a magnetic. Cute. The little face is plush and also the ears and the tail it, they're very soft her legs move now her, she has different texture on her body it's still soft it feels like it's cut curls it's i think it's adorable the way they made this dog and she has a tag of course and her little paws are kind of a faux leather and a dark pink star on the bottom unfortunately she doesn't go in with the pink bows that you can see on the box but you can make your own they're not really that hard you can see barely see her little black eyes or hard plastic and also her little nose is hard plastic she has no mouth on there i wonder how she's gonna eat <laughs> <laughs> and i think it's adorable she's so cute it kind of reminds me of actually a real dog like that small dogs do have like fluffy curly mm -hmm. fur and I just wanted to look, show you guys the daffodil and the sheep who together. They're kind of getting acquainted there. <laughs> and they're different. Their fur, it's hard to explain because in person it's very different. But the daffodil just feels kind of more straight fur. And the poodle does really feel like curly. Like it's, mm -hmm. it's very hard to explain. But you can see in the video the difference between their texture. And I think it's really cool that AD is kind of getting into... Uh, more variety of pets because I remember back 
back when you know they did pets, they just had coconut and licorice. Now they're doing. And they were hard little paperweights. <laughs> Next up, we have the purpley pink kitty, which retails for thirty dollars. This colorful cat is as sweet as can be. Purpley pink kitty loves finding ways to make you smile, like covering you in kitty kisses. Reward her with plenty of playtime. She's so adorable. I like that. It's very interesting that AG decided to not only have dolls with dyed hair, but also pets. I think that's hilarious because I did not know this. In real life, people actually dye their pets. Who knew? Dogs, yeah. <laughs> yeah purple, dogs, pinks. Pink. It's very interesting. Here we have her toy, which is a bundle of yarn, and it's a magnetic toy. It's plastic. I think that's cute. We have a new toy, it looks like. Haven't seen this one before. And she has a little pink nose with a bordered pink mouth. She has blue eyes. She looks so adorable. She's, she's different shades of purple, blue. She has a little bit of pink. And I think that's adorable. She's so cute. She has a little star embroidered on her foot like all the pets. And I just love her little tail. It's so like like movable and just it's so fun to play with. And she's plushy. I wanted also to show you all that the pets have changed their texture because we had some older pets that we wanted to show you a comparison of. And they totally changed the te texture of the like dogs and cats. And I think that's really cool. It's an improvement. The cats are a lot softer. It is definitely an improvement. And here we have Angel. She's saying, hello, kitty. Here we have the group of three. We have the orange tabby in the middle, who's retired, unfortunately. So adorable. His name is Snuggles. And we have the purpley pink kitty and the licorice twist cat, which we also got. So they're both new on both sides of the tabby. And the tabby is like a soft... Is, is a soft animal, but the new cats are more plushy. So he's soft, but not plushy, if that makes any sense. Also, you can kind of tell a little bit the light is shining on Licorice Twist differently. It's like very shiny, and then mm -hmm. this cat is not shiny at all. So you can kind of see with that a little bit. It's really sad that they retired this little kitty. I thought this kitty was adorable. But I guess they had to make way for the retired licorice and the little space Even kitty. the tails are different there. Oh yeah, this, the tails are different. It's more like bent on the tabby and then this on the licorice twist it's like taller. But it's interesting because little, little purpley pink kitty has a smaller tail than the licorice kitty. So I'm not sure if they're deciding to put different lengths of tails on both cats or what. And it's interesting also that they kept the same facial features. All they did was change the texture of the fur. They kept the same like embroidered little details, the nose, the eyes. Definitely you know. improvement though. Yes. Next up is all the puppy set. It retails for $36. And these little puppies are magnetic. As you can see with Coconut is carrying one of the little puppies. So adorable. Mm hmm And they come with a little pet bed and the adoption certificate. It's really a cute set. This set comes with five pieces. You have the certificate of adoption and then you can put your name on it and has officially adopted with the name of your pet. And these actually used to came, come with the bigger pets. I don't know why they stopped doing that. I know, that's sad. Here's a little pet bed. The first little puppy comes with three puppies and the first one is a little gray one with blue eyes and a black nose. It's in a little laying position. I like how they're all in different positions. This is also flocking. The little pets are all flocked and they're all in different colors, which is, it's kind of soft. The next pet is the little tan one and it's in a standing position with dark eyes and a little black nose. I think it's, I think all of these pets also are magnetic. I've already mentioned this, but they also stick to each other. I mean, they not only stick to the dogs, the big dogs, but they also stick to one another, which is kind of cute. The third little puppy it's is funny. a little dark one. I, it's funny that they stick together. Yeah. The third little one is a little dark puppy, a little dark brown with the tongue sticking out, yellow eyes, and a little black nose. He's kind of in a little playful stance, you know, when dogs want to play. And he, I love the tongue. And the tongue's, <laughs> yeah. The tongue so is cute. cute. And here you have the pit pet bed which is pink oh here they are all sticking together like a family should look at that <laughs> it's cute I think that's adorable 
The only downside is you do kind of have to put them a little further apart. Because yeah. even when you put them like a little bit close to each other, they just like immediately stick. But I think that's so cute. That they could like all stick together. I think and that's so adorable. The mother can gather all her puppies. Here there is the pet bed. It's pink with little polka dots, a little cute paw print on there. It fits everybody. You can even lay the mother dog in the pet bed with the puppies. So it's nice and big. Or you can use it just as a pet bed, just for your dog, or even your cat if you wanted to. Tag, of course. <laughs> Giant tag. <laughs> and here they go. Hey, waiting for mom. I think this set would probably get a, a five stars out of five. I think it's a really great pet set. Mm -hmm. I think the only downside is the pet bed is a little too small for the bigger dogs. The sheep mm. could fit. But the bigger dogs, not so much. So here we have Daffodil Doodle holding her little puppy. And I think that's so cool that it looks like a mother holding her puppies. I think it's different. they also look different for each one because they're in different <clears throat> positions. And when you turn the dog around, she cannot hold the dog on a certain side. It's only on a certain side that the dog can hold where the magnet is. So if you turn the dog around, that's, you know, you can't do it that way. That's another downside. You have to do it with the face basically facing you, the puppy's face. I think it's very cute and adorable because it looks like a mom dog carrying her little babies. I think this is an adorable set. Yeah, it's the first time AG has made puppies and I think that is so cute. We hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment down below. We'd love to start a conversation with you. Which pet in this video was your favorite or out of all the new pets, which was your favorite from AG? Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe, share this video with your dolly friends so they can become cuties too. Don't forget to ring that bell so you'll be notified Thank when you we do more Thank you everybody for videos. watching and don't forget to join us next time as, as we focus on the cute. Bye. Bye bye everybody.